Hey everyone, this is Old Junk, aka Nita May, or into my closest friends, Neat. I am at uh, my junk store, so I'm just going to kind of show y'all around a little bit. I've already been shopping and I done checked out, but there um, I haven't really um, showed y'all the place. So let me just take one, just a couple of seconds, and show y'all the place, okay? All right, hang on. All right, y'all, this is the name of it, Open Doors. And so I'm gonna take y'all in and let y'all see just a little bit of it. I'm not gonna be able to take it. This is what it looks like. It's a junk store, y'all. Here's my little car. See my little tag? Y'all don't really need to see all that. But anyway, let me take you over here to this, this little section. This is Miss... Um, this is a little bookstore. The little lady don't open it up much. I want to show you. I don't want to go over there and look at the people's um, video tape their tags or anything, you know. But this is the old, this is what I do. This is where I go. And, you know, you have to dig. And, y'all, it is hot. So I'm not going to spend a whole lot of time. I'm just going to look and let y'all kind of, you know, kind of get a feel to what, um, y'all this is old here see i've got one i've got one of these and i don't need another one see this and look at this right here and y'all and a lot of, i'm gonna probably have some comments from some people but look at this right here uh oh and they've got five dollars on it but this lust i see but see it's it's uh, got a little crack in it love to wear but you just gotta dig and a lot of people what they'll do y'all they just throw this stuff in a box and it breaks it and it's a crying dang shame. It just, oh, 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 look at this, y'all. Look, look, look at that little green chair. You know, it could be fixed up. It's got that little place on it, but anyway. Oh, look at there. A tin in this place is popping. It's a little couch. So I'm just, I'm just kind of just going over it, y'all. All right, oh, my goodness, it's hot in here. Anyway, they've cleaned this out a lot. A little platter over there. Hey, D, look at that platter. <laughs> here's a another room it doesn't have a, a whole lot left in here back in the day y'all when I really really was collecting a lot uh, it used to be called <coughs> excuse me called Mr. Bill's Antique and it did not look like this it was very organized this is a um, a charity type thing where people donate and all, but the, uh, Mr. Bill's was Bill's Antiques. It was antiques. And me and him traded. I would sell him firewood, and I would have like a little. And these are some of his original steins, Mr. Bill's. And I'm not into to that. Uh oh. Well, my husband's calling. Hang on. I'm back, y'all. But anyway, y'all can get a. Uh, y'all can get an idea of. You just have to dig and dig and dig. But y'all can really find some good stuff in here. And uh, I do have a question. There's quite a few of these. See these, but they don't have a bottom to them. See there, there's, there's one, and there's another one. But anyway, do y'all think I need to get those and maybe just hold on to them and, um, you know, to see, you know, to maybe if I can find the bottoms. But like this right here, this is a set of four four dollars but I don't think they're the ones that put the four dollars on there but anyway I could probably get that cheaper here's some stuff I don't even know what this is here see I don't even know what that is see I don't I have no clue there's a little cat I don't know. but anyway y'all I'm gonna take y'all into another room I'm gonna pause it real, pause it real quick Let's see anyway man there's all kinds of linens and who lordy all right y'all let me pause it real quick Here's another room that you go in and you, you get to plunder in. I love plundering, y'all. I love to plunder. Old junk, see? That's why I call myself old junk. See all that? Look, just look at all that stuff up there. All that, see all that's Christmas. It's all Christmas. He'll eventually get all that down. Every bit of that. Is I see something. Look at that. Look at that. Something sticking his head. I don't know what that is. But look. You just get to plunder, and there's boxes, 
upon boxes upon boxes of stuff to plunder. Alright, I'm, I'm going to stop it right here and go into another building and show y'all. And then I got to get home. Here's another building that's full of stuff. This is where I find my salt and pepper shakers. I didn't find any today, y'all. But look. Look at all this. I, let me look and see if this is chalkware right here. No, this isn't. This feels like dang concrete right here. Ooh, that's heavy. Mm -mm. But anyway, y'all, look. This, this, what this is, is one of them... Um, I don't want to say it because I say it wrong. My old southern accent. But anyway. Anyway, y'all. I just wanted to show y'all this. This is a container storage building or something. I don't know how you say it. But anyway. but I've already went. Y'all ain't going to believe this. But I've been through every one of these boxes. I have. Look at all that. All right, y'all. I'm going to stop the video. When I get home, I'm going to do a small haul because I didn't buy much because I just hadn't really felt like digging through the stuff because it's so hot. All right. I'll be back in a little bit. Hey, y'all. I'm back. And I'm going to show y'all the haul that I got. It is not much because I just didn't really feel like being out in all that heat and, um, because the store itself has um, air conditioning, but he didn't have a whole lot of stuff in there, and I didn't really feel like digging. Plus, there were some people in there, and I didn't really feel comfortable about being around them because, you know, the COVID virus. Here comes my cat. The nosy butt. But anyway, the first thing, oh, he's rubbing on my hands. He's sweet. He's that little deaf one. Little, he was. Well, I named him Nova from the road that I got him off of. Let me tell you a little simple story. I was in my dump truck and um uh uh don't you don't you rub on that. He was trying to rub on the camera. And I was in my dump truck and I was hauling a big old huge load of um uh, uncut wood to a firewood man one um fall day. And I seen this little old bitty thing on the side of the road and I said, mm -mm, God, I said, I'm not doing this. I said I'm not, I'm, I'm out of the, uh, rescuing business. <laughs> that dumb truck, I mean, that, uh, firewood man said he's seen that, <laughs> little man, seen that dump truck do a, do a little whoop in the middle of that road. I went back, got him, and have I had him ever since, and my husband kept saying, that thing, that cat's sick. And I said, he can't be sick, I've taken him to the vet, he can't be, because I wasn't going to get attached to him, I was going to try to adopt him out, you know, and, and, um, couple of days before um, I was going to adopt him out, um, I started doing some tests on him. I told my husband, I said, Wesley, I said, that cat is deaf. So the day or two before he was supposed to go, my heart just wouldn't let the little fella go. I just fell in love with him, but I've had to stop. I've got three of them inside my house, and, you know, we adopted that other little white one, and Somehow he has finagled his little happy little behind up in my house. But I told my husband, I said, he's not living in here. I've got two cat litter boxes that's in a closet that I clean out two and three times a day, and I'm tired. Y'all, it takes a lot of effort to clean up after animals. If you're going to have them, you need to clean up after them because they deserve it. Let me get back to my story. Oh, no, my hog. But anyway, y'all, they got them some. They got a bunch of uh, comic books in, and I got this one. This is a Walt Disney, and it's Stormy, and it was ten cents. Well, it, I didn't pay ten cents. I paid a dollar fifty for it. But it was in a ziplock. Y'all look, you know, y'all know me and horses. So look at that, y'all. I'm gonna take it out. Ah, oh, I just love the. I just love everything about it. Ten cents. It's cheap. I wouldn't put my little spectacles on to see how much it, what it, what the year was. There's Pluto. Pluto's on it too. There's a little 
Oh man, but you know what, y'all? I don't care. I, I, I just loved it. Look at that. Oh, the smell, y'all. I just love the smell of it. Hang on. Oh, I just love that smell. Here we go. Copyright 1954. All right, y'all. It's cool. It's got color packages. Look at that. But y'all, isn't that neat? I don't want to handle it too much because I don't want it to fall apart on me. And, but y'all, y'all see it? I'm trying to do some pages on it. Uh oh, ain't that sweet? I'm gonna read it. You know, read it and all, and it's just, I just love anything to do with horses, y'all. Anything to do with horses. I love horses. They got them big, big, big brown eyes, and some of them got blue eyes. And then I picked this piece up because that's sh the store that, you know, I showed y'all and all, um, uh, well, Mr. Bill had it, like I said, it was an antique shop. It was really neat. Everything was in his place. And this preacher man, this guy, I love him. Oh, he's so sweet. He prayed for me, you know, because of my seizures and all. I just love him. Like I said, if things a quarter, 50 cents, a dollar or whatever. And, you know, he's got some stuff. He's getting, he's getting smart now. Five dollars. And it's worth it, y'all. It is. It's worth it. And and he goes. He does not pocket any of that money. It strictly goes to help helping. Like we've got a mission of hope, which is for men. And uh, there's there's a list of charities here for women and men and children, food banks and things like that. that, he, that he helps. And I have no earthly idea who that is. Hello. I'm back. And anyway, uh, there was a piece here, and I'm, I'm believing that it was uh, from the original store, Mr. Bill's, but let me look and see. Well, I, we're not sure, but me and his wife thinks, thinks it was, but I, we're not. Um... Y'all, let me pause this, because I, I forgot to go get my magnifying glass, because there's a, uh, I paid a dollar for this, and like, you know, it's a planner, and it hangs on the wall, but this is irrelevant. This was just a, a marking for Mr. Bill's antiques when he, Mr. Bill was alive and the store was running up. But there's a place right here, and I want to, and I want to get the magnifying glass and look at. It. But I'm gonna pause and I'll be right back. All right, y'all, I'm back. It is so hard to see what this says, but at the very bottom it says "Made in Japan." But for you people out there that n know about pottery and all, now there's no chips and cracks on this, but I'm going to try to spell it out the best way. I, I don't know if it's occupied. I don't think that it says occupied. I don't know. It might say occupied. It doesn't. It's not occupied. I, I don't think it is. But I'm, to me, it looks like why a... Hang on. And the last, the last um, four letters is W A R. So I don't know what that means. It's a long name, and it says made in Japan. So I don't know. But it's a beautiful little piece, little wall. You know, put flowers in or whatever. And uh, there's no chips or cracks or anything on this. But it was some, you know, running when they made it and stuff. And like this right here, this right here, this is in the glaze and stuff. There's no, that's not chips. But I thought it was pretty. I loved it and I got it. And they had more pieces there, but I don't had a few dollars on me. And I'm going to be honest with y'all. I have been buying whew, from sales and stuff. And um, I am not buying anything from sales for a while until I get my bills paid. Because that's something I don't do. I don't go and get in major debt, thousands of dollars. I don't even get in over $300 on my credit card. Because that's just something I don't do. That's just me. I don't do it. If I do, I get stressed out if I get over $300. Or split. I think I'm over like $350, I think. I'm not going to lie to you. But anyway, the next piece that I got is a little salt cellar. Now, I didn't check it out. As usual, so I get so aggravated with my dang self. 
Because I collect these things and I get so aggravated. I'm not doing it to resell them, y'all, but dang, I want them to look good. I washed all this stuff before I showed it to y'all, but see, he's square. And I'm just so, but, but I think she's got another one. He, she had a dollar on it, but it was cheap. And she, she noticed it, and I was like, I'm too lazy to go back there. Give it to me 50 cents. But um, and then I just love them. But I'm going to show you. I know I've showed y'all before, but I'm going to really show you the couple of them that I've got. And um, this one here is round. And it's got some little nicks in it. But I think, I'm going to be honest with y'all. I think folks use these as like a little candle holder thing or something. And these might be candle holders. I might be wrong. I don't know. But to me, I think they're little salt cellars, salt hogs, or whatever you want to call them. I don't know. But I got a little scoop right here. So when you got company, you put like a little, you know, salt in this, put it by their little plate, and they could just dip up and then go, on whatever, however, how much they want. Now this in here is real. And me, I give everything away. I had a couple of these. Nice ones like this, with the lid on them. See that? Oh, I shake. I get nervous because I don't want to drop nothing. And um, I've given a couple of these away. And I can kick my rear end because them right there to me looks like something you pick up at the Dollar Tree. All right, let me show you this one. I don't know what this is. Somebody told me a long time that that's what it was. You put salt in it. I don't know. Um, I don't think there's any markings on this anywhere. No, there isn't. No markings anywhere, but it's adorable. It's got the little feet on the bottom. And I've showed y'all this in the video before, but not up close and personal. But it's a little salt thing. That's what I was told. I don't know. And I don't, haven't looked it up. I need to look them up before I go start running my big fat mouth. And people go, need a mate or old junk. You don't even know what you're talking about because I probably don't. I just like this stuff. You know, I like it and I collect it. You know, y'all, I've got so much stuff. Just let me show you some of the stuff I got. I got two of them just sitting there. I got these. These little forks. See, somebody told me these date back to Civil War. I don't know. See these? Little forks. Look. I mean, this is just, I mean, this is just the tip of the iceberg. But you know what? I like it. And I love it. Yeah, and I'll get some more of it. My husband, I drive him nuts, y'all. But what I'll do is I'll put stuff up in closets in like this little drawer here. And, and I'll just rotate it. And my heart's into the old dough bowls and the old, like, butter molds and old wooden spoons and the old aprons and things like that because you know you sit back and you think man them women back in the day they i mean they really worked their behinds off we got blenders and we got these kitchen aids which i don't have a kitchen aid because i really don't bake that much and cook so much and stuff i have been since i've been off but uh the boys leaving to go on vacation um wednesday y'all get this his mama's got Corona. Hang on, I get it out. Corona. No, it's, that's a drink. COVID. The COVID virus. Mm hmm Yeah. And they're still going on vacation. I'm going to go eat chicken. I haven't been around him. I'm livid right about now. That's all I'm going to say. I'm not saying anything else. I am livid. They've been at the beach. Honey, my butt's been sitting here. My husband's sitting here. We love to camp. We love to take the horse camping. We don't go nowhere. We don't do nothing. They packed them, teen, them big old boys up. They about grown. Teenagers, and they've been going to the beach and all that. Mm -mm. Oh, wet the key. All right. My next little thing I got is a Occupy Japan uh, little vase. And I did not know that the leaf. But like I said, I don't sell, so. And I told my husband he's going to have a field day when I die. <laughs> I'm just being silly today. It's got a, 
uh, a name on the bottom of it. I'm not going to mess it all up and jack it up and everything else for y'all. But isn't that cute? It's a little bud base. Yeah, I like these little tiny ones, you know. See, that's where the, um, no, it's, whoop, whoop, it'd be another, where is it at? It's somewhere around here, the little, um, oh, it's right here. That's where the, um, the, um, leaf is broken off at right there. And my last little piece, y'all, this reminds me of Tammy Roberts. I, this is the Japan. It's not old. It's just, it's not old. And I pay. Now, for that little bud vase, I think I paid a buck for it. And this little thing, I might have paid a dollar and fifty cents for. I didn't spend, but like, um, I think uh, $3 and something. Um, my, no, well, no, I take that back. I, I spent $5 because I went back and I got this little, uh, got that. And uh, this is just a little napkin holder I got. And I thought about Tammy, uh, Tammy Roberts when I got picked this up. I, th I did. I thought about her. See, so you just got a little pan thing on it. It's not old. But, you know, I have a, a lot. I, I don't save them. My husband, you just need to save them. Some of my saving. That's what I got them for. They get, I got them to use them. Those um, um, uh, Ray Dunn napkins. I got those and my and uh, I'm gonna put I got those small ones, you know. I'm gonna use them. I'm gonna put them in that. And so when I've got company coming over or whatever, when I can have company coming over, which now my brother-in-law uh, during which the holidays are coming upon us, and they will be here. And I'm hoping I'm praying that he gets to come for Thanksgiving and Christmas. But my husband's we now us my husband and I we don't have kids. My husband and I normally on Thanksgiving. We, uh, last few years, we'd take the horse and the, and we'd go camping on Thanksgiving. That's what we do. And so, but we hadn't the last couple of years because he would come and my brother-in-law and my sister in Texas would come and we just have ourselves a good old time. And, um, but my husband was like, I just wish that they just, sometimes we could just go camping. And I'm thinking, brother, that's your daggum family. See, I don't have, I don't really have a family. I have y'all. But y'all way out there in YouTube land. But uh, I had to put my legs up. Y'all been working working hard. And I don't know about you women, but I've been cleaning windows and stuff a little bit today. And I get down in my guts, you know, your sides and stuff. When you, uh, I had to pick up my little beagle, which she ain't little, and bathe her little butt today, too. And that kind of hurts sometimes, you know, down in your stomach and stuff. But I had to sit down so I put my legs up. But no, we might go camping on Thanksgiving, and then my brother-in-law might come for Christmas. I'm hoping he'll come for Christmas. It's like, um, you know, to be fun. It's not a big, big thing, you know. And um, I, I, back when we slipped to other place, I used to have Christmas parties and things like that. But, you know, those days seem like they're over with. And sometimes it makes me sad. But um, this with this coro uh, COVID virus, I want to say corona. <laughs> I wish kind of had, I had a corona right about now with a little lime on the top. Not by myself now. I don't want to drink by myself. Who wants to drink by itself? Just one. <laughs> anyway, what time is it anyway? Oh, it's 3 o'clock, but it's 5 o'clock somewhere. But anyway, y'all, I love y'all. I hope you like the video. I know I'm silly. And uh, anyway, I just try to have fun. So if you like, like, share, subscribe, and um, go visit your local charity shops and stay away from folks, of course, you know. But I'm just praying that my husband and I are going to be okay. I know we, I'm, 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 I know we are. I know I am because I hate to stay away from my husband. But uh, he'll be okay. Uh, I'm a, we're going to make an appointment and we're going to get ourselves checked. But uh, I love y'all. Peace out. Like I said, like, share, and subscribe. And I guess I got a button. I mean, a bell or something. I don't know. I, I need to dig all into all this YouTube stuff again. I've been saying I'm going to do it. And I'm going to do it. I just like the basic and the easy stuff, y'all. All right. Peace out.